Welcome back to Still Watching Nile Cruise, and we're still joined with Hassan Shereba. He's the planning and development expert, and we were just discussing the Suez Canal project. And you were telling us or elaborating about uh, your concerns about the project at this stage so far. Uh, there is no uh, specific concern except I want them to work as a teamwork. That's number one. Uh, I want a person like Mamdou Hamza and Sabur to be part of the leaders and they sit together and to shelter the 13 group and be one unit. That's number two. I would like to have uh, a very uh, credibility, a high credibility for the five cities of the Suez Canal, Port Said, Ismailia, Suez, North Sinai, South Sinai, both of them, they should run under a specific law, which is accepted by the government. And when we finish the constitution, which I say, let's go for yes, we were going to have the parliament, and the people of the parliament will accept the law. We want to have one type of law of investment at these areas. Privilege will be given to Egyptians, number one. Number two, I should think of uh, having Egyptian um, spending uh, their money in this project. Yeah. How can you do this? You should show a prime idea and show it on the TV, showing uh, sessions, going and showing this to the everyone. Uh, we have at least 30 million people they own 1,000 Egyptian pounds imagine 30 million by 1,000 Egyptian pounds it is 30 billion Egyptian pounds and you are going to earn let them earn a percentage of 99 percent which the bank is offering today the people will be happy for this why they are earning the money and they are building the future and a thousand pounds which is nothing but you have made all Egyptians to donate and to be inside this project with a very simple action and a simple way this money should start and be involved in this project and if we need some assistance we do have the Arabs Arabs are our back uh, ground, yes. and they are our backbone yes. right now. Like uh, the United Arab Emirates, like Saudi, like Bahrain, like Kuwait, these people, they are willing to invest. By the way, <laughs> Emirates have mm -hmm. spent from, let's say, two weeks ago, yes. investments out of Egypt, and it's, it's a tiny investment. 15 billion US dollars in the United States in chips, microchips. Imagine 15 billion in the United States. And they know that Egypt can, they can spend in Egypt more than this thousand times. They can do it. But they need a vision. Yes. The, the government. In the, and, the, and the economic environment also yes. should be changed. Yes. We need a vision. How can this vision be stable? It's to have the constitution done. Then when you have the constitution, then you have the law, you have yes. stability, you have the army, you have everybody is there. People are... You have a state that will be absolutely. generating Absolutely, you revenues. go for this. Yes, Dr. Hussein Shuraiba, the strategic planning expert, thank you very much for being with us today on my course. Thank you very much. Thank you very, thank much. You very much. And now we leave you with the beautiful tunes of Hosanna. <laughs> 